down in East Liberty, tacos come with a side of language tips. It's the latest project by the Pittsburgh-based company Duolingo. Joining me now is the chef of Duo's Taqueria. We have Marcella Ogrodnik and the tortilla chef Pompilia Andraka. Andraka. Andraka, thank you. Uh, so what are you making for us today? Uh, yeah, so we are mostly known for our tacos at the restaurant, but I really wanted to showcase one of our chicken entrees today. Yeah. We get a lot of requests for chicken tacos at the restaurant. So this is our way to fulfill that need for the customers. Um, so what we do at the restaurant is we have a uh, half roasted chicken and we baste it with an adobo paste. And this adobo paste is a mixture of dried chilies. It has lime and orange juice in it. And do you just baste that on top of that? and Because it has a beautiful coloring. Yes, exactly. And then we, uh, we roast it in the oven. And then um, we put it on the plate here and we serve it with uh, refried beans and a salsa pasilla, which is what you're looking at earlier. So these refried beans here, we get these beans from Mexico. They're a heirloom variety from Oaxaca. And I think that's what makes our beans really special. It's a really simple recipe, and a lot of people love our refried beans. I love refried beans. You gotta start There's, with a good bean. Yeah. To get refried, good refried beans. And so tell us about the sauce because it looks complex and deep and rich. Yes. So this is uh, a salsa pasilla. It's made with the pasilla chili, which is a dried uh, chili that has a lot of raisin like flavor to it. It, it is very complex. It's a little bit like on the sweeter end. It's not very spicy. Uh, so it's something that can be enjoyed by a lot of people. Now you mentioned chicken tacos. So mm -hmm. do you also serve this with a side of tortillas? So you can make it Exactly. Your own? So we serve it with a side of tortillas, which Pompilia is going to talk about how we make our tortillas. Yeah, I'd love to. <laughs> so yeah, how are you making this? Because um, you're moving so fast over here. Yeah, uh, the tortillas, uh, we have our corn. It coming from Oaxaca in another state from Mexico. Uh, they um, send in us directly from Mexico. We have uh, our process like a thousand years ago. They they do our corn turning in this amount uh, in ending in masa. Wow! For ending with delicious tortillas. I, well, you can <laughs> smell it too, just coming yeah. off, and how fresh they are. Watching you roll them and press them. Yeah. It's amazing. And I want to ask you too about really this concept because it's fascinating and it makes so much sense at the same time. Yeah. So how did this all come about? Uh, so Duolingo uh, approached me to partner with them to start a restaurant. So the, the Duolingo aspect of this is that this is a space where people can practice their Spanish skills, but also have amazing Mexican food. So whenever you come into the restaurant, a lot of our servers uh, are able to speak in Spanish or in English to you. So we have coasters on the table and you flip it to English side or Spanish side and uh, you're able to practice your Spanish in kind of a judgment free zone. That's amazing. Yeah. And can you also get some help along the way? Yes. If you need it? Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Everyone is is very generous with, you know, if you make a mistake, no one's going to laugh at you. We have little pointers on the menu on how to speak, a, you know, a couple phrases in Spanish. So, yeah. There is so much going on here that is all working. Yeah, thank That's you. That's amazing. I do like it. <laughs> oh, yeah. my gosh. It's one of our favorite dishes on the menu. Yeah. yeah. And can I, am I allowed to try a tortilla with Yeah, it? sure. Yeah. I cannot wait. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> so this is like a huge part of our restaurant is our tortilla program. Yeah. Tortillas and corn are like the heart of Mexico and Mexican cuisine. So making them from scratch is a really unique thing that we do and uh, we take very seriously. And what are you finding that people gain from coming in? I mean, sure, they're learning some language yeah. skills, but it's more than that, too. Yeah. Um, I think we make the best Mexican food in Pittsburgh, so I think that's a huge win. <laughs> Sorry. I, I'm not going to lie. This is delicious. <laughs> yeah. Good. I'm glad you like it. You should come in to the restaurant, please. It's amazing. Yeah. Um, I also know that there are interactive tips through yes. the restaurant as yeah. well. Can you talk about that? Yeah. So we have these little uh, pucks throughout the restaurant, and they have the Duolingo owl on them. And you can tap your phone to it, and these pucks will uh, give you little tips in Spanish. They'll tell you, they'll translate certain things like la mesa is the table. 
So it, there's a lot of like Duolingo interactive pieces to this restaurant, which is something unique. Not a lot of tech companies own restaurants. So if you want an experiential, you know, unique date night, I think Duo's Taqueria is the perfect place to come. I don't want to leave the kitchen. I'm going to tell you that much yeah. right now. This is so good. Thank you so much for showing up. You're You're welcome. Skill, both of you. This Thank is delicious. You.